So a couple different labs involving instruction decode. The first lab is to uh, decode the instruction type. And for our machine, our CPU, we're not going to implement the full functionality of a RISC-V CPU. We're just going to implement enough functionality to be able to execute our simple program. And our program is written entirely with three instructions, an add instruction, an add immediate instruction, and a branch instruction. So those are the only three instructions that we really need to support in our instruction decode logic. This is the table of instruction types based on the uh, op code from the instruction for RISC-V. Um, and we can simplify things since we only need to support these three instructions. So instead of interpreting this entire table, if you look at the instructions that we need, we can actually just interpret based on the row that we're on. So the first row here we can decode as an I type and the next two rows as R type and the next as B type. So we've got three signals that you're going to assign. Um, the first one's done for you, the is I type, is I instruction. So uh, these two bits here that determine which row we're on are instruction bits six and five. So based on instructions six and five, if uh, you know, for I type, if these bits are zero, zero, so again, using our constant expression notation, a two-bit binary zero, zero value. And again, just to make sure you've got the right tick mark, this is the single quote tick mark. And you'll come up with similar logic expressions for R type and B type.